Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, thanks for stopping by and checking out my channel. My name is Ashley and I am a homeschooling mom of four. Today we're gonna be discussing a little homeschool change up that we've had this year. Um, if you guys were here back in May, April, May, I announced all of our curriculum for the upcoming school year. Um, so I'll link some of those videos if you want to go check them out if this is the first one you're coming upon. But today we're going to be talking about math and we're going to be talking about a little switch that we've made because I want to make sure that you guys are getting current up to date information. I don't want to come on here halfway through the school year and say, hey, we changed this and here's why. So um, you guys know if you've been around my channel for any length of time that I love Horizons math. I have used and taught horizons math every level from k through five my kids one or the other have used them or all of them so horizons math is a super solid math program but but in the higher grade levels there is much 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 more teaching placed on the t the mom or the dad um and that was fine it was fine um but <laughs> If there's a better way, then I'm not against looking into that. So if you've watched any of my curriculum videos, you know previously I had already announced that for my oldest daughter, I wanted to use teaching textbooks. And I showed the physical curriculum in that video. Well, what do you know that teaching textbooks actually reached out to me and um, we started talking about the 3.0 version. So the 3.0 version is a new thing that teaching textbooks has where it's all online. So a lot of you guys already recommended that to me. And so then when I um, started talking with them, I was like, yeah, that's definitely the way to go. So, um, so my daughter started her teaching textbooks pre-algebra this year um, for the sole fact that as she's getting older, I think it's important for her to learn different ways. In college, she might take an online college class. In high school, she might do a little bit of online high school. I don't know what the future holds, but I just want her to be able to learn a subject now that she's getting older and the foundations have been laid various ways. So I also knew that as she's getting into those pre-algebra and algebra concepts that I could help her, but I probably didn't want to be doing like the full on teaching. So I was already kind of, uh, that's what I was thinking when I took her there. So um, I wanna preface the rest of the video with that. So she started it and it was going great. My other ones were still um, using Horizons Math. They actually had a few level, a few pages in their last year's um, workbooks to complete, which is fine because the new books always have some review in the beginning, so we just move past those. Um, however, when my daughter was on this Teaching Textbooks 3.0 website, suddenly all of my kids wanna know why they're not doing math just like her because it's colorful and it's interactive and it's got cute little buddies on the screen and um and she was really liking it so she was like mom i love this new math curriculum saying that in front of her siblings and then her brothers because my little one is too young for um to start it quite yet but her brothers were that's not fair and you guys i'm serious they were getting mad at me um, because they weren't doing the same math as their sister. So I said, all right, let's, no harm in trying it, right? Um, that's the beauty of homeschooling. We can change things up. And I want to let you guys know that I didn't change it up because Horizons isn't great. Horizons is awesome. But there are things about teaching textbooks 3.0 that now that we've been using it for a while, I am like, I am so thankful that I made the switch because it's really lightened my load as their teacher to be able to focus on other things more intentionally. Um, and I have said this before and I'll say it again, we all only have so much energy and mental capacity. And so if your energy is being pointed in a large direction at this subject, then chances are you're not able to give that amount of energy and time to other subjects. So I knew that if I lightened my load in math as far as teaching it, grading it, and that, 
we'll get into that in a second, but um, that I would be able to focus more on other things. So uh, we have been using Teaching Textbooks 3.0 for a while now. My kids absolutely love it. At the end of this video, I will show you some clips to get you a little familiar with it in case you have never looked at it because it is a fairly new thing that they have launched. Um, so some really awesome features about Teaching Textbooks 3.0 are number one, that's applicable to me, um, they have a large family discount. So if you've got kids um, four to eight children, then the cost for the subscription, because it's an online subscription, um, is lessened per child and it actually makes math so so affordable and I am always looking for affordable curriculum options because I've got four kids um, so that is an amazing feature the other really awesome feature for year-round homeschoolers like myself is that it's a 12 month subscription and you have the ability to pause your subscription at any time from your um, parental control area. Um, so it works out really, really well for year round homeschoolers. Um, another thing that my kids love about it that is helping with frustration and tears that sometimes come with math is the hints and clues option. Now, as the parent, you do have control over being able to turn off hints and clues as they do their work, but I have allowed them to keep those on for now and they have really appreciated that because sometimes they don't really need a whole teaching lesson on something. They just need a quick little clue to be reminded and they're good to go. So my kids have really, really loved that. Um, Another thing that's been really fun to see with the Teaching Textbooks 3.0 is my kids wanting to do the bonus rounds. So the bonus rounds um, come at the end of certain lessons where they can get more points added to their grade log by doing a few additional problems. And my son, who is using Math 4 um, Teaching Textbooks, always does the bonus rounds and he loves it. So that's been really, really fun and exciting. They also have free online tutoring when you have the subscription. So say your kiddo is stuck and you're um, it's you're not able to help them or you want them to get more help, you can call and get um, tutoring for free once you've bought your Teaching Textbooks 3.0 subscription and they have free online grade storage. So if you want to look back and see how your child's progressed to where they are now, they hold on to all those grades for you and you don't have to clutter up your house with workbooks and pages. So the fact that it's all online now is really, really awesome. And now here's another thing that, um, that I was pretty excited about and maybe you will relate, but maybe not. Maybe this is just specific to us, but I am pretty strict about screen time with my kids and they don't really just get free time to roam the internet. Um, so my kids actually, are weren't that proficient in like using an actual desktop desktop computer so the fact that their math program is now online is also helping them with their computer and technology skills and i'm really thankful for that um because i would much rather them be doing math than just roaming the internet aimlessly which i don't allowed so that's been really really awesome and then the other huge thing that has blessed my life tremendously is the automatic grading you guys <laughs> the automatic grading when your kids are little and they're just learning addition and counting and tally marks it's very easy, a quick glance through, or probably you're doing it with them, you know that they've understood it. However, when they're in fifth grade, um, last year when my daughter was using Horizons 5, she, um, it was taking me like 30 to 40, 30 minutes each day to go through her work because I had to do it that day to make sure she got it before we moved on. And 30 minutes may not sound like a lot, but I had to do that for my fourth grader and I had to do that for my second grader. So all that combined was like an hour of grading per day because I wasn't sitting there watching her do every single problem. So um, that grading has changed my life. <laughs> it may sound dramatic, but really it's like, amazing and the awesome thing about the grade is say your child doesn't do so great you have the ability to go back and completely wipe that out and have them rework that lesson after you've worked on that um 
material together so it's not like you can't stop and redo or fix it or anything and so that has been really 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 cool and helped me out so much as a homeschooling mom of four um, so I think I've shared with you all of the reasons why I changed my boys over to teaching textbooks along with my daughter. They are all using teaching textbooks 3.0 for math this year. My youngest one is still using Horizons because Math 3 um, is the start for teaching textbooks. I think next year she'll be ready for that. So, um, but I'm not 100% sure on that. But for now, the three using it has been amazing. Um, we, we've loved it. We've loved it so far. So I'm gonna go ahead and insert some clips here to show you a little bit more of what it looks like, how it works. Um, with the teaching textbooks 3.0. So here you can see the parental login screen. I'm just going to enter my password and I will be able to access um, all of the things that are available on the parental side of things. Oops, forgot my password. Let's try that again. So you just click parent and then enter your password and it's going to give you access to a lot of those things I already mentioned. So here's the parent homepage. And then you're gonna see that we have a ton of available options here, ranging from viewing and printing grade books to the answer keys to all of my kids' course levels. Um, so once I get that opened, then I can go ahead and review all of my child's grades for the lessons that they've completed on their level. And you can see down at the bottom for the bonuses and the quizzes, you can see if they've completed any of those or added any additional points onto their grade. So heading back to the main area, you can change the hints and second chances if you don't want your kids to have access to those. And you can also manage your subscriptions right there if you need to pause them. Um, there's the contact information to give them a call for tutoring or help. And it shows you how much time you've got left in your subscription and you can pause them if you need to. So we're gonna log out of the parental area now. And we're going to head over to the student area. So this is the screen your child would see when they are logging into the 3.0 website. They enter in their first name or nickname and their password. When you click log in, you see this main screen here. And then what appears to them is a blank slate that has all of their lessons listed on it, which you will see here in just a moment. So over on the left, you can see all of the lessons. They click on whatever lesson they are on that day, and then from there opens up the um, lecture that they listen to and all of their problems. Here's where you can change your buddies, which is a really fun thing for the kids to do, as well as the wallpaper to the background. Um, my kids really enjoy doing that, so I went ahead and changed his, so he'll have a surprise when he opens it up next time. So going back, you can see their grade book. I always check this before they log out to make sure that everything is good. And that is pretty much the gist of what it looks like from the student section. So we're gonna go ahead and log out here. So now for the really exciting part about this video. Teaching Textbooks has so graciously offered a one-year subscription to one of you guys out there. So I will have the links down below for you to enter that giveaway. It is a free one-year subscription for Teaching Textbooks 3.0 online. I love it. I highly, highly, highly recommend it. I foresee us using it um, for the foreseeable future. So be sure to enter the giveaway. All the information is down below. If you have any questions about teaching textbooks, go ahead and post them in the comments for me and you know I'll get back to you. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.